welcome to today's video. Today's video is a video, not a vlog. Uh, before we start this video, I just wanted to do a disclaimer and say that I realize a lot of you guys, some of you guys are worried about our horse Finn, and I just want to reiterate that we have to trust our own vet, our own equine chiropractor, our own equine massage therapist, the people that work with us and that know our ponies and can access them and feel them and examine them for real. We have to believe in them. We have to trust them. I know that not all of you guys agree with the diagnosis that are that our professionals have made about our horse. I know that some of you guys are on the side of a YouTube channel that have decided what's wrong with our horse through a video. Um, and that's okay. You're allowed to have your own opinion. I, we have to trust our own vet. Like, it's just the way that has to be. I'm sorry if that upsets you guys, but we have to trust our own vet. We can't go out there and try and figure something else for our horse when our vet doesn't agree with the diagnosis that was made by a YouTube channel. And I guess we just have to agree to disagree. You guys agree that you have a, that you guys get to diagnose him. We think that our own equine professional team should diagnose him, and we just have to go with that. But anyways, you guys, welcome <laughs> to today's video. We won't be making any more videos about Finn. I look so pale. Wait, 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 wait. I think we have a foldable table. See, look at oh, dang it, it's gone now. Yeah, Sophie is looking pale. Why are you so pale? Um. Because of the light. Because <laughs> of the lighting. All right, so anyways, we have a video here for you guys today. And we thought this up last night because somebody sent me a message and said, hey, you should try this with your, with your horse. I also want to say thank you to all of you guys who have sent us so much support and understand that we need to trust our own professional equine team that is on the ground here working with us. So many people have sent me messages like, you can always tell when people are genuine and truly concerned because they send their messages to you so that they know that you get them and so that they can talk to you and understand. And I appreciate all of you guys so many supporting messages. I can't even get over it. My phone has been blowing up and I just want to say thank you. I apologize that our comment section has not made you feel comfortable enough to post. A lot of people have said that too. And I'm sorry about that. Our moderators are working hard to restore order so that you guys can feel comfortable again. But anyways, on with the video. You wanna use the pool? Yeah. No, that's too low to the ground. No, that's good for them. It's better for their neck. Oh, I should also say that we... I right. put it over top. No, in the middle over there. Yeah, put it on over top if you want. So I should also say that we don't know everything about horses. We know this much about horses and that is why we rely so heavily on all of our team. And we have such a huge team, you guys. We have like dietitians and vets and, yeah, my horse is a fire breathing dragon. But anyways. My <laughs> um, horse isn't gonna choose any. Okay, okay. Whoa. <laughs> Penny, calm down. You've seen the pool a hundred million times. Calm down. Okay, go ahead and get it set up. Put it on those blocks. It's okay. We love you and it's just the pool that you've seen your whole life that you've lived here. It's okay. <laughs> Daisy, Daisy's like, help, something's happening and I don't know what. Gabby. Get the pool away from me. <laughs> okay, Gabby. <laughs> Things are going badly. Oh my God. Calm down. Stop. 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 Okay, everybody calm down. <laughs> Just put the freaking pool down. Uh-oh. Penny, it's just a pool. Okay, this is not gonna bode well for us. Okay, Gracie is a first contestant in this in this thing. Yeah, Penny is Penny, who's so brave and loves the pool normally, has decided since the pool has been tucked away for a few short weeks that she is terrified of the pool. Alright, we'll fix it so it doesn't Did you fall. See Penny bucking? Yeah, I saw Penny bucking. You're okay, Penny. 
There we go. We got our pool all set up. It won't stay. And maybe it is time to leave the pool. Oh my goodness. This is just a fail of a day. This is just a fail of a day. If it's going to fall when they come over. Okay, so we have it all set up. And the only horse that's afraid of the pool. Yeah, we're going to make sure Penny's okay. Sophia is just acclimatizing Penny and reminding her that the pool is okay. And that she's safe and that it's just a pool. Typically, Penny is super curious and she actually really enjoys the pool and she walks through the pool. And so Sophie's just getting her acclimatized. <laughs> and Penny's like, yeah, I don't really like it, but thank you. <laughs> I know Penny really well and I know that what it takes for her to get used to something is just to be on her own. She's brave and she will always go up to something that she's nervous about and feel it out and see if it's safe all on her own and I like to let her do that. I like to let her do it her own way because then she doesn't feel trapped and she has much better luck with it. So today we have four... I can smell the bananas. Today we have four different treats. We have bananas, we have goldfish, we have horse treats, and we have horse grain. So uh, the horse grain is just a vitamin grain. It doesn't have any molasses or any... Uh, it's not like a performance grain or anything like that. It's just like a stabilizer. It's just vitamin. So today we're going to test our horses and see what they prefer. Do they prefer like their grain? Do they prefer people food like bananas or goldfish? Or do they prefer bananas? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to see if they prefer people food or if they prefer the stuff that they're used to getting as horses. All right, so we're going to set up. This I'll is our one. table. This is our table. <laughs> Got a right you. <laughs> Jesus. Mom. Okay, hold on. No. Penny is oh, not too scared. They all fell. <laughs> Get them. All right, so apparently Penny is not scared of the table. <laughs> what? So we're gonna try and put everything down. Can we the... lock them in their stalls? Yeah. Do one by one? <gasps> Crazy. Penny's going first. Go. No, Penny's going first. She's going first. I want to set it up. Oh God, a Come on in. We want to set up the thing because you guys are into everything. Come on. Come on. She's scared because I'm not normally standing here. here. I'll go in your stall. <laughs> Everybody's so riled up. I thought it was just YouTube, but it's real life. All right, let's set this up. So we're going to make three piles, if we can, of, whoops, that's too many here. We'll eat it all. Knowing all our fat ponies, we're yeah. gonna eat it. Aww. We want to make three piles. Grain's gonna be their least. No, Mom, we already have bananas peeled. You, you have, have three? Two. Okay, we two. need one more. What do we need? Well, no, 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 I got it. <laughs> oh, that was good. And we want to see what our horses choose. Now, when you're dealing with animals or children, you know that nothing ever goes smoothly. Come on. Let's see if my dog will like bananas. Do you like bananas? My dog took it and ran because the ponies were coming. Where did I put it? Thank you. Okay. So we have grain, banana, horse. Oh, wait, do we put this one in? And here? horse treats. So we're going to see where they go first and what they go to. And make a pile, Sophie. Oh, banana. Oh, we need a pile. Yeah, everybody needs a pile. Dogs are like, do a video with me. I want to try treats. Oh, yeah. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to let each horse out. We put them in their stalls because it got, it got crazy once we brought out all the amazing food that we, that we have for them. So we're going to let each horse out and we're going to see where they gravitate gravitate to first and see which one they want to eat. Knowing our horses, they'll just eat whatever they find first. That's okay, so if we leave that one, we'll put that one out after. All right, contestant number one. Contestant number one on the try treats for horses, ponies. Let's see what she chooses. Come on, little pony. Come on. Right, she sees it. She sees the treats. Oh, she does. What does she want first? She smells the goldfish. She goes for the goldfish. 
And the grain. She looks definitely more interested in the grain. Yeah. All right, what else do you like there, little pony? <laughs> it's like a little smorgasbord of snacks for them. Mid-afternoon slump snack. Come and see what else there is. <laughs> Daisy's like, help, help. <laughs> She's eating my food. You're okay. All right, so she definitely prefers the grain to the goldfish. And I wish this was like a, a swirly thing. We could turn it around and see what she thinks of the other treats. We'll swirl it around. She definitely loves the grain. And long ago when we first moved here and Sam tucked all the horses in at night, he didn't close Finn's stall and Finn got out and he got into the grain and that's the grain that he ate. That's the grain that he loved the best. All right. Nope, she doesn't like the goldfish. She likes the grain and she won't even consider anything else because she likes the horse's grain yeah. so much. Isn't that so good? All right, here she goes. Oh, horse treats. She likes those. No banana. No banana. That'd be the first thing I would go for. If there were mints on this table, Willow would be... Oh, she's touched the banana with her mouth a few times. It's still no go. She much prefers the... She doesn't even like the banana. She much, much prefers the horse food. Good job. Aw, she's so good. Oh, okay, get her, get her, get her. She's trying to... She's going to forget about all the rest of this stuff and just go where the rest of the food is. She does not like the banana. She does not like the banana. She does not like the goldfish. Let's see if she'll eat the banana if we hand it to her. Nope. <laughs> no banana, no goldfish, just grain and horse treats. Right. So contestant number one gets two out of four. Hey, come Wait, I wanted to video that. Sophie was trying to take her back to her stall. <laughs> she ran away. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I will eat them all. I want it. <laughs> She's coming back. Go with Sophie. She's got more treats. <gasps> all right. Well, that was very interesting, actually. Did you see that happening? See what happening? Her prefer. <laughs> I left all the treats over there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Contestant number two, who is arguably, not Gabby, who is arguably our funniest of all the ponies. Here she comes, Gracie girl. Gracie girl, Barbie girl, whatever you want to call her. Dun, da, da, da. Look, Gracie, we have a competition here for you. How many of these amazing treats <laughs> straight to, <laughs> straight <laughs> She's like a hurricane. She ate the horse treats. She's eating the grain. Eating the grain. <laughs> she doesn't even lift her face up. Try the goldfish, Gracie girl. She, I don't think she likes the grain. All right, so, so far, two for two. Oh, I'll grab the banana before it falls. Two right. for two, the ponies. Much, oh wait. <laughs> she much prefers is she gonna eat the banana? Is she gonna eat the goldfish? She only likes the grain. The grain and the horse treats. This is why people food is not for horses, you guys. <laughs> she's no. done. No, she's done. Oh, nope, does not like the goldfish. Hates goldfish. All right, there we go. Contestant number two is two for two. Oh, 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 nope. <laughs> she wait, 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 she's going again. No, she doesn't like the goldfish. Bananas. We bought all those bananas just for the horses and they don't even like them. All right, so now we're going to clean off this and start fresh with the banana, with the horse treats and the grain and the goldfish. We're gonna set it all up again for Penny. Know what they put in that grain but all the horses love that grain and it's actually super healthy for them it's like called grow and win and it's supposed to be one of the best freaking belt man foods that you can get look at all of our bananas are in the middle of the horse bucket
Do we have any more horse treats? Yeah, we have a ton. Banana. All right, yeah, so we'll put it on each side of the banana. So she has to go past the banana to see. This is it, this is Penny Pickle. All right. Yeah, contestant number three, the most beautiful horse in the world. And here she comes. Dun, 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 Penny Pickle. Come on. <laughs> she doesn't know. She's not dumb. She saw it all happening. Straight to the bananas. That's my girl. And straight to the grain. <laughs> Which is what they all love the best. It's always about the grain for them. Oh, goldfish. Oh my gosh, she likes goldfish. I knew it. I knew it. Look at her, she's just mowing them down. I That's said that fat. you should use the goldfish and I was correct. That's fat. And try the banana, try the banana. Horse treats. <laughs> she's like, I love those. <laughs> all right, got all the horse treats. Try the banana, try the banana. <laughs> she wants the grain, but at least she tried everything. Like, see, she's eating the goldfish for sure. She didn't try this banana. <sighs> Feed her the banana. Just wait, let's let her finish here. She deserves a right to finish her little smorgasbord of a snack. She loved everything. She is three for four. Is there four things? Three for four, the horse wins. Penny the Pickle wins. That means she's the fattest of them. No, it means she's got a good brain. She yeah. likes to try new things. No, she does not. Um, Our horses do not like bananas. I've seen so many TikToks of people feeding their horses bananas and their and their horses like love them. Bananas? No, I do not want bananas. <laughs> We're gonna try this with our horses at the barn. All right, so Penny is clearly cleaning off our little table here. What if I cover this in the good stuff? Can she be tricked into eating the banana? I'm gonna stick it in the Hold banana. On. I, steal it I think if she actually tried the banana, she might like it, but she's just not brave. She won't. They won't eat bananas. Isn't that so crazy? Like, I've seen so many other horses love bananas. And our mares do not like bananas. But I truly believe that horses know what they need, and they, they listen to their body, and they eat what they need. Maybe she won't eat it because it's dirty. Don't open anymore. I think they just eat what they want. I think that she doesn't need a banana. All right. All right, let's let the ponies out. Clearly Penny has gotten over her issue with the pool, our table, and has found a way to appreciate it. <laughs> so the winner of the uh, do they, what foods do they like challenge is? Penny. 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 Oh, pizza. Oh. It looks like a god. It looks like, let me have some. Grab our bucket there. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. As you can see, my girl was the winner. She wins. She loves swimming pools. No, just joking. Uh-oh, here, take it. She loves food. All of our horses like food, but our horses like horse food better than people food and that's good that's a good thing thank you guys so much for watching again i apologize for all the hate and all the negativity out there on our channel right now i promise it will get better like i said before sophie is on getting ready to embark on a new journey it's already started she is riding chino a lot and she'll be riding him a lot more <laughs> gabby's having a fight with the pool and i hope you guys follow along and watch and wait for the pony the horse that sophie ends up Getting. What kind of horse do you want in the future? Quarter horse. She wants a quarter horse, but what do you want to do with your horse? Do jumpers. She wants to have a horse that does jumpers, and she needs a very specific horse, special for her, and I'm excited to see their journey. And it's like, where'd all my food go? So, uh, Gabby's gonna put this, the pool away. Oh my gosh, look at Penny. And I guarantee they'll all be over there in our little section, trying to get yeah, in, in there. <laughs> They've gotten so good at this. I love that Gracie is such an easygoing little pony and that she allows Molly to ride on her. Like, 
Gracie is such a versatile pony. Like she just loves everybody and everything always. Whoop. <laughs> and she couldn't care less. Obviously, you don't want to try that on a different kind of horse. It's all over, Daddy. It's all dust. Yeah, you're all dusty. Thank you for asking. It's all over. Like, we would not try that on a Penny Pickle. Because Penny is not a lover of everything. <laughs> and our little Dalmatian dog, we would not try it with her either because she's not that kind of a dog. Come on, let's go. As always, we'll see you guys tomorrow.